Namaskar, Namaste, Satnam, Tahom Takurasinosyam, Archikasyam, welcome here. <clears throat> so today we're going to practice a bit of a mixed class. It'll be like a Hatha Kundalini, so we'll call it Hathalini. And uh, what we'll start with is just finding a tall, comfortable seat, finding yourself in Sukhasana, one foot in front of the other, or one shin in front of the other and place your hands face down on your knees. Take a deep breath in and a big sigh. Deep breath in and a big sigh. Deep breath in and a big sigh. And placing your hands down on the knees and we'll start with some supi grind. So inhale, leaning forward. Exhale, leaning back. Inhale, leaning forward. Exhale, leaning back. And pressing into the knees as you move, keeping the hips opening. And a few more here. Inhaling forward, exhale, leaning back. Two more creating these circles around and through the hips and awakening the spine. Pause in center, inhale, straight spine. Exhale, switch whichever leg you have in front. So if you had your right foot in front, bring your left and vice versa. Again, plant the hands on the knees and switch directions of your circle. Inhale forward, exhale back, but going the other way. Maybe you leaned forward and went to the right. Now lean forward and go to the left or whichever is your opposite. If you can't remember, mix it up and go a little bit one side and then a little bit the other side. And we'll do three more. Inhale, straight spine, big sigh, inhale, arms up, palms come together above head, exhale, thumbs to your heart center. Consider an intention for your week this coming week, maybe it's already your afternoon or your evening and you've made it through your Monday, but either way, consider how you'd like the next few days to go, the next week to go. Are you moving into any transitions? Are you completing any projects? Set your intention to see all of your goals fulfilled this week. <clears throat> Inhale your arms up above head. Exhale, fall forward, placing the hands in front of you and straightening out the spine, slowly walking yourself down. You can bring your palms one on top of the other and lay your forehead down onto your palms. Breathing here and grounding yourself into the earth, connecting your intention into the earth beneath you. Find a deep inhale, press into your hands, lift your chest up. Exhale, straighten the arms out in front of you. Inhale. Exhale, walk your hands over to your left side. Lean over the left knee, folding back down. Deep breath here. Big sigh. Inhale, straighten out the arms. Exhale, walk yourself over to the other side sinking over to the right. Deep inhale. Big sigh. Inhale, straighten out the arms. 
Exhale, coming into center. Inhale at center. Exhale, walk your hands back, coming up with a straight spine. Inhale, stretch your left leg out in front of you. Exhale, bring the right to meet it. Inhale, straightening out your spine. Plant your hands on either side of you, coming into a Dandasana pose, but maybe just keeping the knees bent a little bit so you don't overstretch the hamstrings here. We're not gonna be a fully active Dandasana yet and keep a little bend in the knees. Inhale, the arms up. Exhale, fold, and we're gonna repeat this motion. Inhale, rise. Exhale, fold, bowing to yourself and bowing to your higher power. Inhale, rise. Exhale, fold, honoring your body, honoring your mind. Inhale, rise. Exhale, fold, honoring your spirit. <clears throat> Inhale, rise. Exhale, fold. Five more. Feel yourself flowing through your movement. Connecting movement to breath. And fold and relax. Let yourself fall into your fold here. Breathe, 10 breaths. Five big, strong, cleansing inhales and releasing sighs. Inhale. Ha. 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 Inhale. Exhale, walk your hands back along the legs and thighs, coming back up into a straight spine. Inhale, shoulders up to your ears. Exhale, roll them back and down on either side of your hips. <clears throat> Bring your feet back in, one foot in front of the other, finding your Sukhasana. Bring your hands just over the knees, and we're going to do some seated cat-cow. So inhale, chest open. Exhale, spine behind, finding a rhythm. Inhale, chest open, gaze up. Exhale, spine behind. Inhale, gaze up. Exhale, look down. Breathing, inhale, exhale. Gathering energy in the spine, rocking your spinal column, energizing and raising the vibration of the Kundalini up through Shashumna, the central column of the spine. Connecting yourself to your higher self and raising your vibration for the week ahead. Inhale, straight spine. Exhale, make your way onto your hands and knees, bringing the hands in front of you, planting the palms beneath the shoulders, tucking your toes behind you, your knees beneath your hips, body in one long line, starting in your tabletop position. Inhale, look up. Exhale, send the back of the heart up, tuck the tailbone under, belly button up into the spine. Inhale, look up, hips up, belly drops, chest open, shoulders back, gaze forward. Exhale, switching back to your cat pose, sending the spine up, looking down, belly button tucks in, tailbone under. And find a rhythm, 10 more. Throughout your practice, visualize yourself accomplishing all the goals you wish for your week. Visualize yourself feeling your best through your week. Inhale, cow pose, chest up, look up, shoulders away from the ears. Press into the fingertips, pads of the hands and the heels of the hands, tuck the toes, send the hips up and back, downward facing dog. 
chest moves towards the thighs, heels towards the ground. Slight bend in the knees, maybe even a slight bend in the elbows if you tend to hyperextend. Look between the feet and pedal out your feet, bending the knees one at a time, stretching the calves, stretching the hamstrings, lengthening the spine, downward facing dog. <clears throat> Deep inhale. Big sigh. Inhale your right leg up behind you. Exhale, bring that foot in between your hands. Lower your back knee down for a low lunge. Inhale, rise up. Arms come up, inhale. Exhale, plant the hands on either side of that front foot. Straighten out your back leg. Step back, plank pose. Inhale in your plank. Exhale, chaturanga down, elbows tucked in close to your ribs, point your toes behind, inhale, baby cobra, five breaths. Inhale here, big sigh or lion's breath, inhale. Exhale, pressing into the hands, tuck the toes, lift the legs, push the seat up and back, downward facing dog. Inhale, your left leg up. Exhale, bring that foot in between your hands, lower your back knee down, finding your low lunge. Inhale, arms up. Big sigh. Inhale here. Exhale, plant the hands on either side of that front foot, straighten out that back leg. Exhale, step back, plank pose. Inhale. Exhale, chaturanga down to the ground. Inhale, your back bend. Exhale, up and back, downward facing dog. Deep breath here. Exhale, slowly walk your feet one step at a time towards your hands. As you reach towards your hands, settling your feet beneath the hips and parallel to each other, toes spread, bend your knees, Uttanasana, standing forward, fold, fold a lot here with knees bent, lengthen the spine, clasp either elbow, 10 breaths. Find a deep inhale, big sigh, inhale, exhale, release your hands down on onto the mat in front of your toes, inhale, halfway lift on fingertips or hands on your shins, exhale, fold, tuck your belly button into your spine, inhale, rise up to standing, palms come together above head, exhale, thumbs to your heart center, deep breath in. Exhale, release the arms to your sides. Step your feet out wider than hips width distance, so rough to, roughly to set up towards a malasana or a squat pose. And we're going to do a little kundalini exercise here where we're lifting away heaviness, lifting away density and fear, and then we're bringing light in and planting it down into the earth. And we pair this movement of up, up, and down with the mantra Har, Hare, Hari, which are words for praise the God in all things, praise. And so what we're doing is clearing the crown chakra, clearing heaviness, getting rid of doubts, getting rid of stress, getting rid of fear, and charging your whole system for a powerful week to come and even a powerful year to come. And we're moving the whole body here, so after a while you might feel hot. So shake out your body, loosen up the legs, get everything ready to move. And we'll begin with a deep breath, palm strong, elbows just tucked underneath the shoulders. Up, up, down, 
Hat hari hari. 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 Ten more. You can do it. Hat hari hari. 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 Inhale, arms up. Big sigh. Inhale. Exhale, lower the arms down to your sides. Close your eyes. And just breathe deeply into the belly. And start to sway and lightly twist your body to one side and then the other. Bending one knee and then the other. Just getting the body loose. Spinning the energy out into your field. <sighs> Creating lightness in the limbs. And deep breaths, deep breath in, big ha, ah. inhale, ah. Ah. two more, ah. Ah. now start to shake the hands and move side to side with the knees. One knee, then the other, one knee and the other. And shake the hands, shake the arms. Shake the arms up above head. Shake the arms out to your sides. Shake the arms down to the ground and even lean over the legs a little bit. And inhale up, arms up. Exhale out to the sides. Inhale down to the ground. Exhale back to center. Shake out the legs. Release the arms. Shake out the legs. Maybe keep shaking your arms if you want. Okay, and eventually coming back to stillness, bringing your feet underneath the hips parallel to each other. Toes spread wide. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, swan dive forward. Arms out to your sides. Palms strong. Flat back. Release down the hands, inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, plant the hands, step back, plank pose. Inhale, plank. Exhale, elbows tuck in, chaturanga down to the ground. Inhale, your back bend. Exhale, up and back, downward facing dog. Inhale, your right leg up. Exhale, bring that foot in between your hands. Lower your back knee down, low lunge, inhale, rise up. Lean back slightly. Three breaths here this time. Inhale. 
Exhale, plant the hands on either side of that front foot. Straighten out that left leg. Step back, plank pose. Inhale, chaturanga down to the ground. Inhale, your back bend. Exhale, up and back. Downward facing dog. Deep breath in. Big sigh. Inhale, your left leg up. Exhale, bring that foot in between your hands. Lower your back knee down. Inhale, rise up, lean back, look up. Three breaths. Deep inhale. Exhale, plant your hands on either side of that left foot. Inhale, extend the right leg. Exhale, step back, plank pose. Inhale here. Exhale, chaturanga down. Inhale, your back bend. Exhale, up and back, downward facing dog. 10 breaths. Breathing in your downward dog. Finding stillness in your downward dog. Stretching the backs of the legs. Stretching open the spine. Strengthening legs and arms. Breathing deeply. All into one beautiful shape. Deep inhale here. Exhale, lower your knees wide to the edges of your mat. Bring your big toes together. Stretch the arms out in front of you. Sink the chest down for a wide-legged child's pose. Five breaths. press into the hands. Exhale, press your chest up, step the, tuck the toes, pardon me, and send the hips up and back into your downward facing dog. Inhale, bring your right leg up. Exhale, step that foot in between your hands, straighten out that back leg, lifting the heel, pressing into the toes and pressing into the front foot. Inhale, rise up for a high lunge. Arms come up on either side of the ears, five breaths here. Inhale, exhale, plant your hands on either side of that front foot, step the feet back, chaturanga down. Inhale, your back bend. Exhale, up and back, downward facing dog. Inhale, your left leg up behind you. Exhale, bring that foot in between your hands, keep that back leg straight, heel lifted, rise up. High lunge on the opposite side, arms come up on either side of the ears, breathing deeply. Inhale, exhale, plant the hands on either side of that front foot, step the feet back in line, plank pose, inhale, exhale, chaturanga down, inhale, your back bend, exhale, up and back, downward facing dog, deep breath here, big sigh, inhale, exhale, walk the feet to your hands, inhale, halfway lift, Exhale, press into the fingertips, heel toe your feet out to the edges of your mat and point the toes out slightly, preparing for malasana or squat pose. Inhale, straight spine. Exhale, send the seat down towards the floor. Bring your elbows in to meet the knees. Straighten out the spine, lift the chest, look forward, malasana, squat pose. 10 breaths. Deep inhale, exhale, bring your fingertips to the ground and send your hips up and back, feet parallel to each other, fold over the legs, wide-legged standing forward fold.
inhale, halfway lift, exhale, fold. Tuck your belly button into your spine, inhale, rise all the way up. Palms come together above head, bring the thumbs to your heart center. Now you're going to send your feet out even wider and point the toes opposite directions, knees following the toes, coming into a goddess squat. Inhale the arms out, elbows in line with the shoulders, cactus arms. Tuck the tailbone under slightly, tuck the belly button in, shoulders away from the ears, breathing here. Inhale, straighten out the legs, palms come together above head. Exhale, sink back in, we'll do 11. Inhale, rise. Exhale, sink down. Inhale, rise. Exhale, sink down. Seven more. Inhale, rising up, straight legs. Exhale, feet parallel to each other, fold forward, reach forward, pause halfway. Inhale, arms out to your sides. Exhale, fold, hands on the ankles. Fold inward, breathing here, wide legged standing forward, fold. shoulders, lift up onto fingertips, halfway lift, big breath out, <sighs> inhale, lift your heels, rising up onto the toes, breathe here, five breaths. Sink the heels, point the toes out, bend the knees, rise back up, goddess pose, arms out in line with the shoulders, elbows bent, cactus arms, breathe here, five breaths. Inhale, rise up, straight legs. Exhale, palms come to your heart center. Heel toe or hop your feet together, finding your mountain pose, Tadasana. Inhale here, big sigh. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, bend your right knee, bring your right ankle into your right hand. Squeeze the heel towards the buttocks and relax here, left arm facing forward, keeping your Tadasana stance in the rest of the body while bending and stretching the quadricep on the right side. Breathing here. Keeping the heel close to the seat. Inhale the left arm up. Exhale, lean forward very slightly. Bend your left knee a little bit if you need to. Breathe here, five breaths. Inhale, straightening out. Exhale, release that foot and lower the arm. Shake out the arms, shake out the legs. Distribute your weight into your left foot now, switching sides. Sorry, weight, <laughs> right foot, switching sides. Bring your left foot into your left hand. Deep breath here. Inhale your right arm up, exhale lean forward slightly, maybe a slight bend in that right leg, breathe here.
straightening out. Exhale, release that left foot and lower the right arm. Shake out the arms, shake out the legs. Inhale, the arms up. Exhale, swan dive forward. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, plant your hands, step your feet back, plank pose. Inhale, plank. Exhale, chaturanga down. Inhale, your back bend. Exhale, up and back, downward facing dog. Deep breath in. Exhale, lower your knees down onto the mat. Point your toes behind. Sit down onto your heels. Inhale here. Exhale, walk your hands behind you. Just leaning back, bending the elbows slightly. Five breaths. Deep inhale, exhale, walking your hands back forward, coming back up onto your knees. Inhale, shoulders up to your ears. Exhale, roll them back and down. Take a deep breath. Exhale, interlace your hands behind you, reaching the hands back, lean back on your hands, open the chest, breathe. Inhale, exhale, tuck your belly button into your spine, supporting with your core. Inhale, straighten out. Exhale, pressing into the tops of the feet, pressing into the knees. Lean forward, bringing the hands up behind the shoulders, forehead to your mat. Breathe here. Inhale, rise up, straight spine, pulling yourself up with those hands. Exhale, release the hands to your sides. Inhale, shoulders roll up to your ears. Exhale, shoulders roll back and down twice more. Inhale, shoulders roll up. Exhale, shoulders roll back and down. One more time, inhale, shoulders roll up to your ears. Exhale, roll the shoulders back and down. Inhale here. Exhale, walk your hands out in front of you, coming into tabletop position. Hands beneath the shoulders, fingers are spread, toes are tucked behind you. Inhale, cow pose. Exhale, cat. Four more. Inhale, open the chest. Exhale, walk the hands forward, coming down to puppy dog or anahatasana, heart melting pose. Sinking the chest to the ground, resting your chin or forehead on the mat. Breathe here, 10 breaths. Take a deep inhale, exhale, press into your fingertips, lift your chest, straighten out the arms, inhale, exhale, walk the hands back into your tabletop, hands beneath shoulders, fingers spread, press into the fingertips, press into the pads and heels of the hands, tuck the toes, send the hips up and back, downward facing dog, belly button tucked into the spine, heels heading towards the ground, gaze between the feet, inhale, big sigh, Inhale here. Exhale, walk your feet to your hands. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Tuck your belly button into your spine. Inhale, rise all the way up to standing. Exhale, palms come to your heart center. Inhale. Exhale, release your hands out into mountain pose. We're going to move into Natarajasana dancer pose. Spreading the toes wide. Maybe I have to do it like this. 
spreading the toes wide, bending your right knee, taking hold of your right ankle. Inhale your left arm in front of you. Now you're going to press that right foot into the right hand, flexing that right foot, pulling the right arm back with the right ankle, and then leaning forward with a slight bend in that left leg, left arm reaching to the sky, finding your dancer pose, Shiva's pose, Natarajasana. Deep inhale, exhale, slowly rise back up, release that right leg down, left arm down. Inhale, arms up, exhale, fold, inhale, halfway lift, exhale, plant the hands, send the feet back, plank pose, chaturanga to the ground. Inhale, your back bend, exhale, up and back, downward facing dog. Deep breath here, big sigh. Inhale, exhale, bring the feet to your hands. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Tuck your belly button into your spine. Inhale, rise up. Exhale, palms come down to your heart center. Inhale, exhale, mountain pose. Setting up for your dancer pose on the opposite side. Inhale, exhale, bend your left knee. Take your left ankle into your left hand. Inhale, your right arm up. Exhale, start to push that left foot into the left hand, lengthening the arm. And leaning forward, slight bend in that right leg. Leaning forward, chest towards the ground. Finding your Natarajasana. Deep inhale, big sigh, inhale, rise back up, exhale, release the leg, release the arm, inhale, arms up, exhale, fold forward, inhale, halfway lift, exhale, plant your hands, step back, plank pose, inhale, plank, exhale, chaturanga down, inhale, your back bend. Exhale, up and back, downward facing dog. Deep inhale, big sigh. Inhale here. Exhale, lower down onto your knees. And sit down to meet your heels. Breathing here. Deep breath in, big sigh. You're going to bring your hands into temple mudra, bringing your left hand in front and then your right hand to meet. You're going to cross your thumbs over, left over right to balance feminine energy, right over left to balance masculine energy. You're going to keep the index fingers elongated, so pointing, and then interlace the other three fingers, finding your temple mudra or kali mudra. Inhale the arms up above head, and you're going to imagine that this is a sword and you're going to cut out all the negative associations with, with life out of your way. You're going to cut away old, unserving relationships, toxic patterns, or toxic habits. On the inhale, you'll say, Sat. And then on the exhale, you'll lower the arms down in front of you, as if you're chopping wood, or cutting through a wire, or cutting through a ribbon. And you're going to say, Nam. So inhale, arms up, sat, nam, sat, nam, yep, sat, nam, sat, nam. Cut out the old, cut away all the bull, cut away anything that is no longer serving. Sat, nam, 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 truth, name, truth, name, sat, nam, sat, nam, sat, nam, sat, nam, sat, nam, sat, 
nam, sat, nam, sat, nam, sat, nam, sat, nam, sat, nam, sat, nam. Really see yourself winning all your battles. Sat, nam, sat, nam, sat, nam. And turning battles into opportunities to learn, grow, and play. Sat, nam, sat, nam, sat, nam, sat, nam, sat, nam, sat, nam, sat, nam. One more minute. Sat nam, 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 sat nam. Sat Nam. Inhale, arms up. Close your eyes. Look up towards your third eye. Breathe here. Deep inhale. Fill with as much air as you can. Hold your breath. Inhale a little bit more. Big sigh. Release the arms. <sighs> inhale, shoulders up to your ears. Exhale, roll them back and down, and fold forward over the knees into Garbhasana, Embryo Pose. Forehead down to the mat, arms to your sides. Breathe here, one minute. Deep breath, big sigh, <sighs> inhale, exhale, bring your arms out in front of you, inhale, press into the hands, straighten out the arms, exhale, pull yourself forward into your tabletop, hands beneath the shoulders, inhale, cow pose, exhale, tuck the toes, send the hips up and back, downward facing dog, deep breath here, big sigh, <sighs> inhale, Exhale, walk your feet to your hands, fold over your legs, standing forward fold, take hold of either elbow, relax into your fold. Deep inhale, exhale, tuck your belly button into your spine, inhale, rise up, palms come together above head, exhale, lower them down to your heart, inhale here, exhale, find your mountain pose, deep breath in your mountain pose, big sigh. Just breathe here, standing in your power, standing in your strength, in your mountain pose. Envision yourself triumphing over all challenges you may face, moving through life with grace, ease, and boundless strength, infinite potential. And we're gonna take some time to shake the energy in the spine. So you're gonna have your feet a little bit wider than hips width distance and kind of 
lift your heels and stay mostly up on your toes. And bend the knees a bit and start to bounce the heels, bounce the knees. Shake the, let the arms be loose and let them shake. Maybe even shake the head. And just get your whole body shaking and shaking the spine, shaking the lymph nodes, draining lymph nodes, moving energy in the kidneys and the organs, shaking everything out. And take this opportunity to imagine all the old ways of your mind just shaking away and falling away to the ground, even shaking off problems of other people or problems of the world. Take a deep breath in, big sigh, two more. Inhale, exhale, step your feet a little bit wider, bend your knees a bit, you're gonna inhale the arms up, exhale, fold, inhale, arms up. We'll do 10 of those. Five more. One last one. Inhale, arms up, reach. Exhale, bring the arms out to your sides, palms face forward. Spread your feet out a little bit more so the toes point out, coming into star pose. Imagine yourself shining light out your fingertips, out your toes out into your field, protecting you for the week to come. You are surrounded in sacred, divine energy. God is with you in all forms. Love is running through you into all things. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, palms to your heart. Hop your feet together. Inhale, arms up again. Lean back, gaze towards the thumbs. Exhale, fall forward, swan dive. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, plant your hands, step your feet back, plank pose, chaturanga to the ground. Inhale, your back bend. Exhale, up and back, downward facing dog. Pedal the feet here. Deep inhale, exhale, bring your knees down, hips width, or sorry, as wide as your mat, toes together, sink your chest down, reach the arms forward, child's pose. Find a deep breath, inhale, exhale, come down flat onto your belly, stretch your legs out behind you, bringing the elbows beneath your shoulders, forearms parallel, coming into a sphinx posture, 10 breaths here.
deep inhale. Exhale, stretch the arms out in front of you, lay down flat. Inhale, exhale, glue your legs together, feet together. Inhale, reach your arms behind you as if you could reach your fingertips to touch your heels even though you can't. Inhale, lift your legs up straight, lift the chest up coming into half locust, five breaths. <sighs> Lifting your legs off the ground, engaging thighs, engaging glutes. Engaging all the muscles of the spine, reach towards your heels with the hands, inhale, big sigh, two more breaths, inhale, exhale, lower down onto your belly, flat, breathe. Deep inhale, exhale, bend your knees, bringing your right heel and then your left heel in towards your seat. Clasp your ankles with your hands, breathing here. Inhale, flex your feet, and then start to push your arms with your ankles. Coming up into a bow pose, lifting the chest, lifting the heart, gaze forward, thighs off the ground, chest off the ground, arms stretched long, hands holding ankles, feet flexed, breathe. Deep inhale, exhale, slowly release, and release the legs, flatten out, inhale, reach the arms forward, and rest for 10 breaths. Deep inhale, big sigh, two more, inhale. <sighs> inhale here, exhale, plant your hands beneath your shoulders, tuck your toes, inhale, exhale, push your hips up and back, downward facing dog, last downward facing dog. 10 breaths here, breathe deeply, feel the legs stretching, feel the spine opening, arms strengthening. Look between the toes, really let the head and neck relax, lengthen that spine. your feet to your hands, inhale, halfway lift, exhale, bend your knees a lot, bring your seat to meet your heels, bring the thighs in line with each other, knees full parallel to the ground, coming into a toe squat, inhale, arms out and up, exhale, thumbs to your heart, breathing here in your toe squat.
deep inhale. Exhale, release the fingertips to the sides of the hips and let yourself fall down onto your seat. Inhale, stretch your legs out in front of you. Pull the flesh of your seat out from underneath you so you're right on the sits bones. Straighten out the spine, flex your feet. Press the thighs into your mat, hands just in front of your hips. Find your Dandasana, strong, powerful staff pose. Gather strength in your whole body here, 10 breaths. Inhale your arms up, exhale slowly, fold over your legs, let the legs relax, feet falling out and opening, <clears throat> bringing your chest over the thighs and folding over the knees, coming into caterpillar pose. Breathe here, three minutes. Allowing yourself to deepen into this stretch and keep your breath nice and deep. Really allowing this posture to open your whole being to receiving light through the crown and healing in every cell as you soften in. We'll be here for another minute and a half. Just relax into it. And if you feel it gets too intense, you can walk yourself up a little bit and just rest part way into the stretch. Staying in your fold, take a deep breath in and a big sigh. Nine more deep breaths. 
Big sigh. <sighs> Exhale, roll them back and down. And bend your knees in towards your chest and bring your hands on top of your shins. Roll yourself back onto your spine. And we'll just spend about 30 seconds rolling here. Have some fun rolling along the back of your spine. Think of a fun time when you played as a child somewhere. Just rolling around, rolling down a hill maybe, or doing somersaults. into the air, feet flexed towards the ceiling, toes pointing towards your forehead, and bring your hands stacked underneath the hips so that you can rest here easily for a while, or more easily. If you need to put a cushion underneath your seat, feel free. And just breathe here, we'll be here for one minute. Deep breath in, big sigh, deep breath in, big sigh, one more, inhale, big breath out, inhale here, exhale, release your hands from underneath you, and bring the arms out to a T or cactus arms at shoulder height, inhale, exhale, bend your knees in towards your chest a little bit. Inhale here, 
Exhale, lower your knees over to your right side, coming into a two-knee twist towards the right. Inhale, look over your left shoulder with the head. Breathe. Find a deep inhale, exhale, belly button into your spine, inhale, knees up, in line with the hips, big breath in, big breath out, <sighs> inhale here, exhale, tuck your belly button into your spine, lower the knees down to the opposite side, coming into your two knee twist towards the left, and look over your right shoulder. Deep inhale, big sigh, tucking your belly button in, inhale, the knees up in line with the hips, exhale, lower the legs down, take a deep breath here, big sigh, and one more time, inhale, the legs up, inhale, the arms up, and you're just going to shake your legs and shake your arms and get all the rest of the energy out that you no longer need. Flutter the lips, <laughs> make some noise, <laughs> get out whatever you might have stuck in your body, any frustration, any stuck energy, any old energy, shake it away, 30 seconds, go for it. <laughs> Inhale, legs up, arms up, big sigh. Inhale, arms behind your head, lower your legs down, point your toes, reach your arms, stretch your whole body long. Five breaths here. Deep inhale. Big sigh. And just ask yourself, is there anything else I need before I relax into Shavasana? Another twist, an inversion, a plow pose. Does anything occur to you? Or are you ready to simply settle in and integrate your practice, allowing yourself to lay down onto your back when you're ready and taking your time to slow down Settle, integrate, sink into the earth, and allow Shavasana to take you into the time of letting go completely so that the old can die away and you can be reborn anew after your practice. So if you haven't already, lay down onto your back and let yourself sink in for your Shavasana. Giving yourself some nice time to integrate your practice and let your cells become nourished by the yoga.
bring your awareness back into your breath, taking a deep breath in through your nose, and a big sigh. Two more, inhale, and release. Inhale, light, love, and healing. Exhale, all else. Start to wiggle your fingers and wiggle your toes. Maybe rolling your wrists, rolling your ankles, rolling your head and neck side to side. Slowly waking up your body again. Maybe bringing your knees into your chest. Or maybe rolling onto one side and making your way up into a seat, taking your time and moving in your own way to make your way up into a seat to close our practice today. Inhale the arms up above head, exhale thumbs to your heart center, and think of something you are grateful for. And set an intention for your week. Thank you for joining me for this practice and may you be charged with lots of loving, blessed energy for your coming week. Sat nam, namaste, salam, ahom, atakuyasi, nosyam, Blessed be to you. Thank you for your practice today.